What's going on guys, Nick Ross here, and one of my best attributes is my back, as you can see. A lot of people ask me what I do for my width and thickness, so I'm gonna show you right now. So something people neglect because people love these deadlifts and compound movement, which are very good for your uh, overall development, but pull-ups guys, pull-ups. Now it's not just doing a pull-up, but it's how you do the pull-up, okay? So for instance, a lot of people grab the bar and they just go up and down like that. What you should do to really get that overall back activation, have a slight lean. So you're really gonna keep your chest high, like that, okay? So instead of just being straight, boom, that's what you wanna do. And you're gonna pull from there, just like that. Just like that. Now this is kind of in the way, so I couldn't really get that full contraction at the top. But it's all about just kind of arching your back a little bit, fixing your body in a way where you feel more the lower lats and the rhomboids. Because when I'm up straight, for me now, I feel more biceps and forearms. And when I'm doing back, I don't want to work biceps and forearms, right? So when you do your pull-ups, guys, I recommend having that slight lean. You're going to activate more of the lats. That's what I do. That's what I recommend for thickness, width, size, just overall density in the back. So... Thank you very much. Thank you very much for watching the video. If you like this tank top, if you like this tank top, link is down below. Discount code be well 30 if you like these pants. Link is down below. Discount code be well 30 guys. I appreciate the support. Um, thank you as always. Share the video, like the video, comment on the video. Give you a quick pause. Real quick. Boom. Bye-bye.